uh, all government will need to discuss next week, uh, as uh, Mr. Katainen said, will be migration. Even, even if we made progress in the management of the migratory flows, the situation is still very fragile. We need to be all committed to implement the agreed, I repeat, the agreed measures and find a way forward to complete the structural reforms. The credibility of our actions inside the Union, at our borders and in our migration management is central to building mutual trust and enable us to act in a collective way. Our comprehensive European agenda on migration contains elements of solidarity and responsibility. It demands that we take forward each element in parallel. The success of one reinforces the others. In all areas, we must both show solidarity and assume responsibility. It is the moment now to prove it. What do we really mean whenever we make reference to this basic principles upon which Europe is built. And the more effectively we work with third country partners on tackling the root cause of migration, the greater our capacity to ensure a fair and effective system of asylum and migration management here in the European Union. Ladies and gentlemen, March 2017 will be a month when many people look to Europe's past and many people look to Europe's future. In the Commission, we will make sure that we also shape Europe's present. Thank you. Dear colleagues, um, there has been uh, plenty of discussion this afternoon about uh, the future and the past. The Commission must also live in the present. Since the Bratislava summit in September, we have been working hard to deliver on a unifying set of priority issues. President Juncker has shown again today his commitment and the commitment of the whole Commission to deliver him by presenting his white paper in line with the promise before this House in his State of the Union speech. Life goes on and uh, our work goes on. The European Union is 60 years young. That means that we are old enough and wise enough not to get distracted from the task at hand today. And we are also young enough, energetic enough, and enthusiastic enough to make sure we deliver what we promise. Next week's European Council must be about delivery. Delivery, delivery is the most important point on this issue. Europe needs to deliver on migration, deliver on jobs and prosperity, deliver on security, and deliver on all of its agreed priorities. The European Commission will continue to deliver. Thank you, Mr. President.